On Law Weekly today, some lawyers give their opinions on the call for the elevation of senior lawyers to the bench. We also have a recap of the top legal stories. And in our interview segment, we chat with a leading women rights activist and lawyer, Mrs. Fumi Falano. Mrs. Falano has published many articles and books on the rights of the girl child, as well as the rights of women. In this interview, we talk about the safety of the girl child and the child rights law, especially against the background of the recent abduction of a minor, Ese Ururu. That's the lineup on this edition of Law Weekly. Hello and welcome to the program. I am Shola Sheedi. The Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Mahmoud Mohamed, recently debunked claims by the Nigerian Bar Association that he prevented the consideration of senior advocates of Nigeria for appointment as justices of the Supreme Court. The NBA, at the end of its National Executive Council meeting in Jos, reportedly accused the leadership of the judiciary of deliberately obstructing the senior lawyers from being appointed to the bench. Though the CJN has said that the National Judicial Council complied with the new revised NJC guidelines for the appointment of judicial officers of all superior courts of record, Law Weekly sought the views of some lawyers on the move to have senior lawyers elevated to the bench. We already have lawyers being appointed to, to high courts and federal high court um, benches. But if you're talking about the Court of Appeal and the Supreme Court, we've had instances in the past where people like um, uh, and Justice Elias and Paul were elevated straight from the bar to, to, to the bench. I don't see anything wrong in senior lawyers being appointed justices of the Court of Appeal and justices of the Supreme Court. Because, I mean, they bring in their wealth of experience. And um, uh, when you have someone who has practiced law, applying the law, it makes a whole lot of difference. So I don't have any, I, I think it will be a good thing. It will be a good day for us in the legal profession. It's not only in this claim. I know that in other places, like in England, in US, and in Canada, people, professors from the universities have been picked and moved straight to the bench, higher bench, maybe Court of Appeal, or even the Supreme Court of the, of the, of the system. Uh, it, not, it mustn't be those judges from the Court of Appeal. Because picking judges from the High Court to Court of Appeal elevation and from Court of Appeal to the Supreme Court has actually weighed down on the capacity of judges. More or less, some of the judicial officers feel they owe allegiance to the government appointed them. So sometimes judgments are tilted, the favor of government doesn't matter wh uh, which house is being called. But like when independent lawyers, like senior lawyers, are being appointed to those senior um, officers in the bench, fine, that would be good because they will bring the experience to bear. And of course, they, because they're made in the legal practice, uh, they have been known, they will fear nobody. And that's where justice will actually will come to play. The law does not insist that the person to be appointed as DJ must come from amongst the justices of the Supreme Court. So legally speaking, it is um, it's possible. Then uh, speaking for myself, I believe uh, say it will be a good development and it, in my own view, um, it will go a long way in trying to combat the issue of corruption in the judiciary by bringing somebody from outside the judicial system to head the court in the country so we can come up with policies and then be able to take charge of the whole judicial process. What yardstick will be used um, in elevating the senior lawyers um, so that it won't be business as usual? A lot of things are good on paper in Nigeria, but the practicality is, um, is what is always in question. Are we going to get a panel of um, maybe retired judges who will be independent that can really go through the track records of these lawyers, I mean, of this year, of these senior lawyers to be sure that they are fit and proper to be on bench? Um, I know those clamoring for it believe that as um, lawyers, senior lawyers, they are successful and they've reached the peak of their career. But I think um, in doing that, it goes beyond that. Uh, we have to really sit down and um, think up a framework that will really work going on understanding the peculiarity of, um, the, of the Nigerian judicial system.